How's it going? I have a very special lens to review today. This is the TT Artisans 21mm f1.5 lens for Leica M mount. I have it on a helicoid adapter here, adapted to my a7 III, my Sony a7 III. One thing you must know about this lens though before you go any further, this is manual focus only. We are in the manual focus zone. It's pretty small, it's compact, it's about 400 grams in weight. So I went out, I did a field test with this. I'm gonna show you a bunch of footage and then I'm gonna talk a little bit more about it. So for my field test, I used the Moment 6 liter sling bag and the Peak Design travel tripod and the Moment 77 millimeter variable neutral density filter with my focus shifter adapter. And I used my Peak Design travel tripod as a sort of shoulder cam hack. Basically the point of this is to give my handheld footage a little bit of a weightier heavy camera look so it didn't have the normal jitters that you get when you shoot with a mirrorless camera handheld. And of course, Kobe, as usual, was my lovely model. We were filming in natural light and I filmed everything at f1.5. White balance was just standard 5600K daylight. I like the fact that I'm able to open up to f1.5 at 21 millimeters. It's a pretty unique kind of look. It's very wide, yet you still get that separation between your subject and the background. This was manual focus. I cranked it with my focus shifter And I also use my hand sometimes to hand crank it. One thing I found really cool about using this helicoid adapter is that it allowed me to get extremely close focus. The bokeh of the lens, if you're a bokeh snob, is a little bit unpleasant, I'd say, because it has sort of um, an outline to the out of focus areas, like you can sort of see a ring. It's not a 100% smooth fall off in the bokeh. So you may hold that against the lens. It didn't really bother me too much regardless. For my nighttime test, I took off the variable ND filter, but the rest of the configuration remained the same. The flare looked pretty well controlled. I didn't get that crazy overblown flare that you get with a lot of vintage lenses. I did find that there was a drop off in sharpness at f1.5, especially if I was using a variable ND filter in front of it. I'm not sure why this was, why I noticed this so much more with this lens as opposed to other lenses where I've used VNDs, but in the footage I noticed a little bit of haloing. I tried a couple different variable NDs and I still saw this. So maybe this isn't so much the fault of the lens, maybe this is just the result of using a variable ND on such a wide lens. You should know that it only goes up to f16. So what do I think of the TT Artisans 21mm f1.5 lens overall? Well, I really, really like shooting with it. It has the right size for my kinds of setup. I like to keep things small and compact. It's really easy to gauge the manual focus because the focus throw is only about this far. So it feels like a natural focus throw and it has this handy little uh, sort of finger uh, hook here that you can put your finger in that makes it easy to slide back and forth across the entire focus range. Now the main drawback to this lens that I found is if you don't use a helicoid adapter, if you just use a standard Leica M to Sony E adapter, then you will not be able to focus very close. The minimum focus distance is 0.7 meters, 0.7 meters, which is not very close at all. It means you can't do head and shoulders close-ups of people with this lens if you do not use the helicoid. This is the helicoid ring. And this is the normal focus ring. This is nice and comfortable to turn. Ah, I like that. This is really thin and kind of hard to crank, and it's not as fun to focus with. I don't like focusing with the helicoid, but if I want to go past my usual minimum focus distance of 0.7 meters, this is a necessity. And this will get you in trouble if you try to use an external follow focus unit. If you're trying to put like the geared follow focus on top of this, there's no space here to add it. 
So basically that's why I wish that the lens itself just focused a little bit closer, but I did a little bit of research and it turns out this is a pretty common issue among Leica M lenses. They don't have the greatest minimum focus distance in general. Okay, so this has been my take on the TT Artisan's 21 millimeter f1.5 lens. There's a link in the description in case you wanna purchase. And if you wanna see more videos by me, go ahead and click subscribe and click the bell to get notifications. All right, I will see you next time. Come on.